Hi, friends. Want to know how? I brought in an extra... Okay, I'm going to stop acting like that. I brought in an extra $38,207.13 as a part-time coach? Question mark. Dot, dot, dot. You're in the right place. Hey, girl. Hey, I'm Dr. AJ Austin. So happy to be here with you, as you can tell. I have caffeine today? A little, not a whole lot. Most of this is natural energy. So if you're new to my tribe, hey girl, if you've been here before, you know this is the norm. If I'm not acting like this, then you'd be like, Dr. AJ, are you okay? I am. So I am the founder of the International Center for Life Coach Training, LLC, where I train and certify black women of faith online in one day. Not only is it, is it possible, but I've done it 100 times. And 47 times as we speak. And I make money doing it. So over the last year, we introduced a new component to what I do as a part-time coach. Now for me, I've always worked part-time jobs in my life. I actually kind of loathed uh, nine to fives because I wanted to work, make money and leave and go do what I wanted to do and just use the money to play and cover my expenses. That was pretty much it. And so when I decided to become a certified life coach back in 2013, I also wanted to run my business part-time. And so what I did was got certified back in 2013. And then I discovered a way that I could take that certification and start multiplying the money that I was making as a coach. And it was by discovering my own personal coaching style. So just like I didn't want to work full-time as an employee, By the way, my shirt says employee of the month. That's a joke. Um, I am the employee of the month in my own company. You should be too. Mm Mm-hmm. Little peach tea from Starbucks. No ice. Okay. So I said, you know what? I want to run my business part-time. And I also don't want a lot of responsibility in my business. I knew that coming in years ago. And so I knew I had to get creative with how I would make my money as a coach. And now that's what I teach in my one day life coach certification class. And so on Tuesday, February 25th, and I'm going to post this in the, in the comments as I talk to you live here on Facebook, YouTube, say hello. Um, let me know you watch this video over at www.futureblacklifecoach.com. I'm typing, talking, and trying not to let my phone fall. <laughs> www.futureblacklifecoach.com. Dot com. There we go. It's in the comments. I am about to pin it if Facebook will let me be great. There we go. It took a minute, but we made it. Uh, we're doing a three day life coach challenge. And this challenge is for people who are coachable. That means you know how to follow instructions, that means that you know how to turn on your listening ears and don't try to skip steps into that first step that I told you that I did to bring in this extra $38,000 in my coaching company within the last few months. Now, it took less than a year to do this, by the way. Um, And so I say that because on Tuesday, February 25th, 2021, we're doing a three-day challenge. I'm gonna show up here with you guys live daily maybe audio live and maybe in person, but we have a private Facebook group for those who choose to join us in three day challenge by going to futureblacklifecoach.com. That's number one, because what that's going to do is introduce you to the first step I took on this journey to 38 K in such a short time in my coaching business, working part time. I'm going to show you how I do it by leading by example. Okay. So if you want to follow my lead, head over to futureblacklifecoach.com right now. Secure your spot. Yes, there's a tiny investment. But again, that shows if you're willing to invest in your knowledge and in your next level. Got to be willing to invest. Um, So I am showing you what I did and I'm introducing you to what it looks like to start off getting certified. So for me, certification represents here you are this expert at something. Here you are, this black woman of faith, by the way, that's who the challenge is for, that's who my trainings are for, that's who my coaching certification program is for. And I've done lives previous to this one that tells you why I work with black women of faith. By the way, I got some extra bonuses downloaded in my spirit today, and I'm like, we're just immaculate creatures. So black woman of faith, 
you are that person with the heart to serve and to help others and you're tired of being burnt out and not being paid for your gift and your skill, but you're still pouring out, serving, ministering, giving away stuff for free, including your time and your knowledge. And now you're ready to get paid for that time and that knowledge. As a coach, when you decide to say, I'm tired of working for free, it's time to put a fee behind it. You need to know how to do it. And it usually comes when you settle your spirit, settle your thoughts, sit with yourself and the vision God has downloaded into your heart and get a little bit of piece of paper called a life coach, certi uh, life coach certificate showing that you're certified. You've studied the process of how this works. You've studied the unfolding of introducing your knowledge to the world and putting a price on it that starts the process, right? And then there are other steps that you can take that I'm happy to hold your hand through after the three-day challenge is taking place on Tuesday, February 23rd, 2021, over at futureblacklifecoach.com. But your first step, I will not give you all the answers. Some of y'all are looking for quick ways out. Go ahead and log off. Find another video to watch. Go stop somebody else on YouTube or Facebook live stream. But if you will allow me to lay out step by step, show you the way step by step of how I brought in that extra $38,207.13 in less than a year as a part-time coach, not giving away all my time, not giving away all my knowledge and making money, then head over to futureblacklifecoach.com because that's what it's about. Who here has questions? I'm happy to answer any questions you have about the challenge that we're doing because it is three days. I'm doing a live every day leading up to the three days that fills in some of the blanks, answers to some of the questions. Because on the next part of today's live, I want to tell you how you know that you qualify to take that next step in becoming a certified life coach. There's something we call coaching qualities. And so God gave me this. I had to write it down and I'm bringing it to you. So I'm going to list off some of the things that if this is you, then your next step should be to head over to futureblacklifecoach.com. Okay, here we go. So you have a heart to serve. You're always helping. You are a great listener, and people have told you that, and maybe even you caught yourself listening real good, aka being real nosy. You're very supportive. You are always the cheerleader for people's ideas and dreams and goals, and you're like, yes, go do it, sis. I got your back. I support you. You're the phone that rings. Your phone rings. When your friends get downloads and ahas and ideas, they got to run it by somebody and they want it to be you because of your support. You're very supportive. You often find yourself giving advice and sharing your opinions. You're that person that people call when they need a word of prayer, a word of encouragement, a word of motivation. They need to hear what thus saith the Lord and they know you probably know what God is saying or they've heard what God is saying and they know that you're the friend to confirm it. You're always praying with other people. I remember I was in a corporate position, met a lady in the bathroom. She told me she was having a tough time on her job down the hallway from mine, and we prayed. And I remember throughout that prayer in the bathroom with just me and her, one of my other coworkers walked in, and she just could not believe in such a great way how the power of prayer works and to see me do it in action. I've always been that friend. So if that's you always praying with somebody, always pouring into someone or speaking life or positivity into other people, always volunteering your time or your services, or maybe you got friends and family that volunteer you. I know my family for years would call me because they knew I knew the answer. So are you that friend where they're like, oh, she can do it. Oh, she got it. Oh, she knows the answer. You're the smart friend and you're the strong friend. You're the friend that everybody thinks everything is okay in their life. Nothing is going wrong in their life. We don't need to check on them. They always call and check on us. And when we say, how are you? You always say, I'm good. But you really need another strong friend and support in your life as well. You're always being called on. Or you're always being led to lead. I know for me, if I join groups or programs or classes or organizations that the leadership is just not where I want it to be, I will raise my hand, or I used to, <laughs> to take the lead. And we take on all of these responsibilities on 
school boards and volunteer committees because we have that leadership quality. So we're always being called on to lead or we're always feeling that tug in our heart to lead. Is this you? Does any of this sound like you so far? Do you have those coaching qualities? Hey, Yolanda Logan, how are you? So when it comes to making money as a coach, it's not just about making money as a coach. It's about having these qualities that's going to lead to making that type of money as a coach. You may think $38,000 is just like, eh, I spent that on my last vacation. Good for you. You can log off. This is not for you. But if you're like, sis, I could use the extra $38,000 right now. I could use, <laughs> you know, the coins to go do what I want to do to expand my business, to make a greater impact. As a matter of fact, I can double that if you can just teach me how to get there keep listening because this is the video for you okay so we've told you about your qualities i told you in the first few seconds of this video how i made the money that's just one stream of income you guys in my part-time life coaching company and i told you that i have mapped out the way and i'm introducing you to those ways over at futureblacklifecoach.com and you have to join today in order to see what the VIP goodies are because it buys you a VIP pass into our world. I'll try to talk more about that coming up. But if you're always taking the lead um, and you also are highly honored, highly revered, um, highly respected, everybody may not like you. You may not be everybody's cup of tea, but everybody respects you. And what I mean by that is they don't curse around you. They don't smoke around you. They don't gossip around you. They don't disrespect anything about what they know about you because they know your values. They know your heart as a black woman of faith. And so they respect it. I literally just got off the phone with a high school friend who told me that um, not basically not to worry about why my friends list was not expansive in high school. It was because everybody respected that I was the church girl. I was also the truth teller. I didn't take a lot of junk. You know, I told it straight like it is. I didn't play. I was focused and I was about my business. My goal was to graduate high school. She was like, but on the other end, she was hanging with the smokers and the drinkers and the cursers and the partiers. And, the, and it was no judgment. I just always wondered why I didn't get the invite to the party. But it was because my friends knew, even in high school, to respect my values. They knew not to cross the boundaries that I had set. Still the same thing in life. My family knows you can't call me gossiping. I don't care who pregnant. I'm tired of hearing about everybody's funeral and what date it is. And you want to be there because you want to be on the front row. No, ma'am. But we can talk about money. We can talk about the Lord. We can talk about coaching and life goals. We can talk about our next level and expanding our dreams and our businesses. So it's only so much that you can allow in your space as a black woman of faith who is a certified life coach and you have to set those boundaries. Maybe that's you because people respect you and where you are. It's not that you put fear in their heart, but you just stand for something. People will pay you for what you stand for. Believe me, it is true. If you're that person that not only do people listen to you and respect you, but people have always told you, either they you've heard them say it or you like me, you get the emails, you get the inboxes of people telling you just how you've helped change their day or their life, how you reaching back and giving them some advice, listening to them, praying with them, helping them, talking with them, letting them just get it all out, made a difference in their day. You possess a really, really good coaching quality. Um, if people have told you, hey, Wendy uh, Jackson, if people have told you how much you've helped them um, and how much, you know, you mean to where they are in their life now, whether it was yesterday or years ago, you have an important coaching quality. As I mentioned, you are that strong friend. You are the, the one in your friend group that everybody knows to come to. You're the wise one. Everybody respects your wisdom. You're the go-to friend or family member. Everybody expects you to succeed. They're like, you're so smart. You're so good at who you are. You should be a millionaire by now. You should be rich by now. You are the wise one that everybody expects to achieve great things in their life. Everybody assumes that you're okay because they never see you break a sweat. They never see you cry. They only see you serve and minister and help other people. Who am I speaking to right now? Because if none of these describe you, you may not be ready to become a life coach. 
But if you've heard at least one thing that you can resonate with, I encourage and invite you to visit futureblacklifecoach.com right now. Sign up for the upcoming three-day Black Life Coach Challenge. We have a private Facebook group that the challenge is taking place in, and it's full of so many goodies, like the book that I wrote called The Life Coach Revisited, as well as some really fun trainings that I've already put together for you that are instantly downloadable into your email inbox that come along with the challenge so that you can jump in and get your feet wet with what's expected to come along the journey and the ride of becoming a certified life coach so that you can be on your way to making the type of money that you want to make. Maybe you have an income goal that you're striving for this year. Let's get you started, sis. It's out there because some of the final qualities of a coach is not only do people know that you're the wise one or you're the go-to family or friend or people expect you to succeed. They just assume that you're okay in life. They assume that your life is good because you're the educated one. Again, you're the smart one in your family and friends group and they know that you live to give. They expect it of you. If you're not giving, they're like, what's wrong with you? (laughs) And so whether you're giving advice or giving a helping hand or wisdom or those golden nuggets in life, if you meet any of these coaching qualities, you qualify to become a certified life coach. Notice I didn't say you have to have a degree. You have to have a certain other certification. You have to have done this type of work for years. I didn't say any of that. Out of all of those coaching qualities, out of the ones that I mentioned, which ones stand out to you? Let me see some feedback in the comments below if you ain't scared. If you scared, I understand. You can just secretly make your way to futureblacklifecoach.com. But if you feel like I just called you out <laughs> to the carpet, like it's your time to shine, sis. Let's take all of those qualities, package them up, and put a monetary value on them so that you too can add additional tens of thousands of dollars to your income, revenue, sales stream this year in your life and or in your business. Whether you coach part-time, on the side, after nine to five hours, on the weekends, (laughs) once a month, or whether you go full-time like I do and you wake up and this is all you do, but it's still considered part-time work for me. So how I have my business set up is semi-passively. That's what I call it, where trainings that I have, like those bonus trainings that are waiting for you over at futureblacklifecoach.com, they're already ready to go. You and 20 other people could be listening to the same training and all of you guys are getting blessed and you're getting exactly what you need from those trainings. That's semi-passively. But I show up on platforms like this, whether it's live or audio or doing... um, Other trainings that you'll see me share with you throughout the year, I still show up live. Everything is not hands-off. I am working to be more hands-off in my business, but that's the beauty of becoming a life coach, having clear goals, knowing where the money is, or like the man say, where the money resides, and then being able to teach you those steps. That's how we grow together. So I love that I can reach back into my community and get you. Are you ready, sis? Because y'all are quiet. Y'all ain't saying nothing. I need to see some comments real quick to be like, AJ, I meet at least some of those qualities that you just called out in those coaching qualities. AJ, I'm ready to get certified. AJ, educate me. AJ, coach me. Yes, I want your step-by-step guidance in live, (laughs) actionable time on how you made your money and how I can do the same thing. Can I get like a comment, a question? If not, don't worry about it. I'll give you back the rest of your day. This is only for people who are ready. I understand some people need to lurk. You need to stalk and watch. You come on to hear me to, to hear me say your name. You come on to be nosy. Like, what kind of area she got? Where's she at? What's in her background? What she got on today? Let me see if her eyebrows done. I like her glasses. Wonder why that light is in her eye. I get it. That used to be me until I decided, let me focus on my goal and dream that I know God has called me to. And as a result, he's placed the right people and coaches in my path to help me get to the next level. So, If this is convicting your spirit, you're welcome. I look forward to having you in the three-day Life Coach Challenge. It's over at www.futureblacklifecoach.com. I'm actually heading there now so that I can add some more goodies that you get as instantly downloadable bonuses when you join me in the three-day masterclass. If you have questions and I'm no longer live or if you're listening on YouTube, talk to me in the comments below. Let me know if I stepped on some toes. (laughs) You're welcome. 
And I'll see you soon. Until we meet again, my friends, remember, there's someone somewhere. Oh, they're waiting on you <laughs> to walk in your destiny so they can walk into theirs. Because it's when you let your own light shine, you give others permission to do the same. Again, I'm Dr. AJ Austin. Thank you for joining me live. Hey, replay viewers. Hey, YouTube viewers. Talk to me in the comments below, and I'll see you soon. Meet me over at futureblacklifecoach.com. Bye, future black life coach.